again everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another speed build video in the sims 4 happy friday i hope you're all having the most amazing day ever so far and thank you so much for joining me here today for a very spooky apartment speed build we are in san maishuno in 17 coal pepper house if my memory is serving me correctly and i think it is and we are well and truly getting into the spooky season here and this is one of my favorite times of year and i want to try and just get every second of it that i can and just enjoy it so i really hope you guys enjoy this video this apartment is fantastic for any sim who really really loves halloween and or spooky day as it's known in the sims 4 if you have seasons installed and if you like spooky day or halloween in real life then this is perfect for you too this is an ideal apartment for a single sim or a couple of sims who enjoy throwing halloween parties or you could even place this lot down and just throw a halloween party and then be done with it like whatever you want to do with this uh please feel free to do so and let me know what you decide to do with this apartment i know it's a bit niche however i have been really in like looking forward to doing this apartment more than anything else i've had it in the pipeline for a little while and i thought it would just be a really nice video to put out on friday i'm also releasing a video on sunday as well so you guys have had a fair few videos this week i think this will be my fourth video this week which is so refreshing and so nice for me because i love producing content and it's so nice to be able to produce more content when i have the time to do it so we are currently working on the kitchen here as you can see it doesn't look particularly spooky yet but we are starting to add some items especially from the spooky stuff pack i am speaking of the spooky stuff pack i am actually hosting a giveaway over on my twitter at the moment if you're not following me over on there then i am throwing a spooky giveaway at the moment which uh, basically means if you join the giveaway you have a chance of winning a few packs and I believe I'm just trying to think I believe you can win the werewolves pack and paranormal stuff pack and the spooky stuff pack I've bundled them all together so the winner will receive all three so if you are interested then head over onto my twitter at the moment if you if you haven't already got spooky the spooky stuff pack I would recommend highly recommend it especially for anyone that loves halloween and loves decorating their sims houses for halloween i obviously as you can see absolutely love doing this i am planning on releasing i don't know whether to do it on sunday or not i've got another build in the pipeline but i've also got this build sort of almost ready to go as well it's like a, a red sort of victorian townhouse that's sort of decorated for halloween and it's really cute and then i have a very special build video in mind for releasing on halloween because my birthday is actually after halloween and i was thinking of releasing a very special video on halloween anyway <laughs> we are now working on the living room here you can see i went all out with the decor in this apartment and it was it's so much fun to do these builds because whilst i love doing the builds that i do that I often do on the channel should I say and I love doing them it's sometimes nice to do a build that's really themed as well because you can just go for it and whilst this apartment might not be ideal for you know like the average sim to live in <laughs> as I was saying at the beginning if you want to download this and just pop it in the 17 cold pepper house space and your sims want to throw a halloween party just for the night then this is an ideal place to do that and that was for me that's definitely what i would be more leaning towards if i was doing this build uh, not doing this build if i was doing gameplay and i saw this apartment i'd be definitely tempted to just download it and have it as like a one-off halloween party night sort of situation you can pop a scary film on the tv get some popcorn put some music on get some costumes on your sims and just have an absolute blast we do end up changing up the sofas because these are the ones from the Desert Lux kit which I've never actually used before and whilst they look okay I decided to use the sofas from the university pack in the green swatch because I thought they looked a little bit better um, so I end up doing that in just a little while I, I revisited this apartment over the space of two days and yesterday evening I started it I've finished it this evening so it's actually Thursday while I'm recording this I'm pre-recording which is very unlike me usually I'll do a voiceover for the day <laughs> and then re-upload later on that day so pre-recording for me it's a bit of a 
unfamiliar territory I think is probably what I would describe it as but it feels good it feels good to be a little bit more organized and ahead of the game I suppose you could say <laughs> so just adding some final touches to the living room here I really went as I was as I was just saying I really went all out with the decor and the items that came with the particularly the spooky stuff pack came in really handy for this build along with a lot of the autumnal items from seasons as well I thought that worked really well and this rug <laughs> we need to talk about it because it's fantastic i don't get the opportunity to use it enough because it's very specific it's, sorry let me start again it's a very specific style of rug and it only really goes with specific kinds of builds <laughs> i.e something like this but it's fantastic the swatches are a lot of fun and as i was saying it's so nice that we have these items in game for people like me who <laughs> absolutely love going to town on halloween decor my house in real life is currently decorated for autumn slash Halloween and I had such a good time doing my own house in real life and every time I go into a room I'm like that's really sweet I've got pumpkins everywhere we've got like a little pumpkin a porcelain pumpkin on our windowsill in the bedroom and we've got pumpkin candles everywhere and I, I love walking into a room and just seeing Halloween decor does anybody else love doing that because I do I I know from a very young age I've always loved Halloween and I always dreamed of having my own house one day that I could actually decorate it for Halloween so very lucky but also to be able to actually do this in the sims as well and just go completely all out on a on a on an apartment build like this as well and obviously we're doing the house builds and things too but it's always nice to do apartment builds as well because I don't do them very often on the channel anymore and I don't know whether I should do more of them. You'll have to let me know. I can talk, I promise. You'll have to let me know in the comments down below <laughs> if you think we should do more apartments on the channel and if so, what kind of apartments do you want to see? I love doing apartment builds. I used to do a lot of them previously and for some reason I have just sort of shifted more towards house speed builds but if you want to see more apartments then I'm more than happy I'm more than happy to do them because I do love doing them anyway this is the bedroom <laughs> it's the only bedroom in the apartment it's a one bedroom one bathroom apartment and I just moved on my chair so I'm sorry if you heard that this is not a squeaky chair at all but it just made a bit of a noise uh, <laughs> the bedroom was slightly challenging because I didn't know whether to carry on the spooky theme throughout the entire build and I very quickly decided that that's exactly what I was going to do so <laughs> this entire build is just a sea of orange and black decor <laughs> filled with pumpkins and spooky lights and I love this so much I can imagine if I had an apartment of my own this is probably what mine would look like around this time of year Luckily, I have a house and a husband that keeps me in check, but <laughs> my husband loves Halloween just as much as I do, though, so I don't know how that would really work if we had an apartment. <laughs> anyway, the bedroom didn't take me long to do at all. It's just me basically trying to navigate and figure out where I want to put things. I love that little beanbag chair from the high school years pack. I thought that fit really well in that corner there as well, so I'm really, I'm really pleased with that. And just adding some final touches here, adding a mirror on the wall and a clock and then another bookcase, which is the same from the one in the living room, but I thought it worked well in there, so why not use it in here as well? Maybe the Sim got it from Simkia or something, Ikea, I don't know what you would call it in The Sims. <laughs> Even the bathroom, it's not spooky, but like I've never really used black toilets and black showers, but I, I did in this build because I thought they, were, they would work really, really well. <laughs> So just finishing off here with some pumpkins and some more autumnal decor and then we move on to the one and only bathroom in the build which is just off the entrance here <laughs> and then that's that's pretty much it for the build so i will leave you in peace now so you can get this apartment from the gallery right now my origin id is rachel ped tray files as always will be linked down in the description box below you can get them for free from sim file share keep out keep an eye out excuse me for sunday's video you all take care thank you so much for joining me here today and i will see you next time i post a video bye